good evening friends so let us start with the second module equilibrium of coplanar concurrent force system so before going to start uh, with the second module first you must understand what do you mean by the equilibrium of forces equilibrium is nothing but so whenever you consider any body or a object if it is subjected to the number of forces under the action of all these forces the body is remains under the state of rest then it is said to be at an equilibrium condition for example so if you consider a beam which is subjected to the number of forces external forces even though the body is not moving the body is at rest so then the body is considered to be as in equilibrium so here we are having the some of the principles of equilibrium so what do you mean by the principle of equilibrium the body is said to be under the state of equilibrium so when the algebraic sum of all the forces acting on a body is equal to 0 and also the moment acting on a body at a particular point is equal to the zero you can see here the algebraic sum of the forces is nothing but we are having the two types of forces horizontal forces and the vertical forces the algebraic sum of horizontal and vertical forces if it is zero and the moment acting on a body is zero then the body is said to be is in equilibrium condition so we can discuss what do you mean by exactly the equilibrium is nothing but a body is said to be in equilibrium when there is no any translation means there is no any moment of the body there is no any rotation of the body even though under the action of the external forces so i have discussed the different uh, system of forces so we can discuss so what are all the equilibrium conditions for different force system so first there is a coplanar concurrent force system as we know concurrent is nothing but the line of action of all the forces are meeting at a same point if the line of forces are meeting at a same point then the moment will be zero therefore we are having only the t2 equilibrium condition summation of fx is zero and summation of your phase zero this is what the equilibrium condition in case of coplanar concurrent force system and next type of force system is coplanar non concurrent force system as the name indicates non concurrent means the line of action of the forces are not meeting at the same point then there is a moment will exists therefore the equilibrium conditions we can consider both summation of fx0 summation of fy0 and moment at any point acting on a object or a beam has been considered as zero similarly in the parallel forces we can have all the three equilibrium condition and non coplanar forces since we are having the three directions x y z therefore fx fy and fz as well as the moment is equal to the zero this is what the concept of equilibrium is nothing but the body is said to be is in equilibrium when the all the forces acting on a body then also the body is remains in the state of rest then it is said to be the body is in equilibrium condition 